Tap Tap here. Welcome back to Cave Story. It's been quite a while, but I've decided the way I was originally intending to do this Let's Play wasn't really that great of an idea. So I was basically trying to do the majority of the game pretty much blind. And I thought maybe it'd be more interesting to see a player go through it the first time, but after attempting that, I don't really think that's a good idea unless it's something like Mario Adventure where I can just, you know, use save states and I don't really give a crap. But for a game like this, I want to actually show it off and to do that, I have to know what the hell is going on basically. So I'm going to finish this run just because I may as well. And I'll just do almost all of it with the machine gun because next run I won't have the machine gun. And then eventually I'll do a proper run through of the whole game and know what I'm doing for the whole time instead of, you know, just screwing around for most of the time. What made me really decide was. Coming up here, the game gets a bit harder, and there's this one thing that I was stuck on. It's actually a really stupid thing to get stuck on, but I'll show you what I mean eventually. And this game also has branching endings, if you didn't know that, and so we just missed up the chance to go for the first ending, which is the worst and easiest ending. If you leave on the Sky Dragon, you get a pretty sad ending where you just flee the island and evil winds and everything, and you're just sort of a coward. And then there's... I'm going to do the second ending, which is pretty much the normal video game ending. And then there's a harder ending to get, and I'm going to be getting the second ending for this run because... I'm not quite good enough yet to do the hard part of the third ending. So when I do my good run through, I'll just do the third ending that time. What's with all these humans being turned into rabbit people? Well, I guess it's Misery. She's kind of a jerk. We're at the plantation. The poor mimigas are growing the red flowers. Passage question mark? What's going on in here? There's some weird names. There's a tree dude. You're making a statue of the doctor, aren't you? I don't like you, tree dude. But I can't kill you. I notice they're all wearing the crown. They're all evil people. But I can't blow up the statue, so I'll just continue on. Nothing up there. Yeah, when I was originally recording the plantation, and I had no idea what I was doing, I realized I was sort of in over my head. At least because the game is mostly pretty linear, but... This is just sort of a big open area, and I realized I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. So that was fun. Hey, buddy. Uh, what's going on, you mimi guys? Not very much, apparently. Nope. Why'd you guys take an oath of silence or something? Ouch. Rest area. Hey, it's that Fisher dude. Hey, Fisher dude. Yes, we have. Yep, Misery's still a freaking jerk. See ya, buddy. What's going on, other mini guys? Well, you're all giving me the silent treatment, too. Well, I didn't want to talk to you guys anyway. So, there. I don't know what this is. You can get in this little nook here, but 
There doesn't seem to be anything to do. Those little beanstalk guys, or bean plant guys, are sort of freaks. Yep, silent. As always. Oh, they're not supposed to talk to humans. Except I'm a robot, but I look like a human, I guess. I like to think I do. What is up here? Lots of dragonflies, apparently. Let's kill all of the dragonflies for no real reason. Gel number two. Aw, poor Mimi, guys. I'm not a killer robot. I mean, I kill lots of things, but that's no reason to call me a killer robot. I mean, I kill bad things, so that's... that's cool, right? Nope, oh, they got turned into rabbits, probably. This misery's a frickin' jerk. There's a teleporter here. Sure. Let's go. Hey, we're at this place. Where that guy was from the beginning of the game. So that means we're back in Grass Town. Oh, I miss this music. But we can't stay here. It's probably my favorite music track in the game. Though I do like the music in the plantation, too. Grass Town is just a lot happier and... I don't know, just my favorite. Let's continue on up here. Let's continue on through the massive swarm of dragonflies. Ooh, and it's another life up, finally. It's been a long time since we got one of those. I still think that sounds like Metroid. It's a big bat again. Whoops. Just another reason to love the machine gun. Let's kill this big freaking bat. And this little whatever he is, tree dude. Another door. Let's go in here. Hey, it's Sue. Sue, get over here. I can't do anything. Well, bye, Sue. You're a jerk, tree dude. You just die. Yeah, this is the part I got stuck at. Because I sort of, you know, ignored the whole obvious death warning thing here and tried to fly up there and it seems possible at first because if you time the jumps just right with the booster 2.0 it works but then there's there's just a whole bunch of those heavy press enemies that kill you instantly and you can't possibly dodge them with our current equipment Let's take <clears throat> excuse me. Let's take a look down under this bridge here. Hey, it's Curly! What's going on, Curly? Lose your memory? What's up, Cthulhu? Well, you're a jerk, Cthulhu. That sounds good. And yep, that's what that black mushroom is that I met earlier. Gunfish. What's going on, gunfish? These guys are basically platforms, but... I think you can stand on just about any enemy in the game, if not every enemy in the game. They don't actually hurt you if you just stand on them. 
Though most of the bosses will still hurt you if you stand on them. What do we got? We get a teleporter room key. Another reason I was stuck was I got that key and I did not know where it goes. Because I found that other teleporter up there first and I did not realize that I didn't use the key. Hey buddy, you're... oh, you're one of those tree things. Why can't I kill you? Well, I guess you're a cool dude, so I won't kill you. Sure. Let's make the shortcut. Hey, what? Oh, you are a jerk. You are a jerk. Yep, we're dead. We're just dead. 